So this creative agent receives the request from its main agent up here, and it itself sends over these really you know high quality prompts for image to video and for video, and then also the same thing with the images. And so the reason I wanted to bring this up is because this is GPT-5 mini that's creating these prompts over here, as you can see, it's sending over this, this full video prompt to the workflow. And when I was brainstorming about building this system, my idea was that I was gonna go into this workflow, I was gonna have the main one send over an initial small prompt, and then I was gonna use like a prompt AI agent in this flow that would be super, super prompted on how to create like a structured JSON prompt. I'm sure you guys have seen like VO3 JSON prompting all over X, LinkedIn, stuff like that. And so that's what I was gonna do. And I started off doing that and then it just became like not very consistent and it, it wasn't super, super good. And it also was like very specific to one use case. And then I just basically gave the agent a little more autonomy and I was really happy with the output. So for now it's like this, I'm happy with it. But once again, if you had a very specific use case where you would need this media agent to make certain types of content, really easy to just basically move over this trigger, put an AI agent right here and have the AI agent create a very specific prompt for you. You know, I think even if I go into the workflow history real quick, we can see that that's the route that I was taking initially earlier today.